Yes. <laughs> I have quite a bit of time this morning, so I thought I'd go back to some of the pictures that according to the law, <laughs> you ought not torment an innocent because such is a man whose crimes have not been proven. Yes. <laughs> now, just thinking about it, <laughs> You didn't decide that you weren't going to use the magistrate judge system, did you? Oh, <laughs> because procedure is the central part of any legal system. <laughs> now, I have documented quite a few lawsuits, and you decided that you were going to continue to violate the laws of the United States. Yes. Uh -huh. And that uh, you were not going to acknowledge the rules of procedure must transcend positive law. <laughs> now, I have a lot of these pictures. Yes. <laughs> now, what I want you to do, okay, consequently, the rules of procedure could not be omitted by judges or princes. <laughs> What's the actual procedure when issuing a protection order? <laughs> Notice to the respondent at least five judicial days prior to having a court hearing. Yes. And the petitioner has to appear in, in court and acknowledge receipt of the court order. Now you're going to make it worse today and I'm going to sue you for X number of billions of fucking dollars right now. Now, uh, it's an absolute, uh, the right of the defendant to have his case heard uh, in court was absolute, not contingent. You can't say, well, <laughs> Heidi moved to Clallam County and you issued a protection order where I've never been convicted of any domestic violence or child abuse. <laughs> you're not going to let me speak to my sons and you're going to make it worse and I'm going to sue you for refusing to acknowledge the procedures of law. <laughs> Now let's see, proceed against a person if he had not cited him. Since a summons had been established by natural law, the Pope himself could not admit it. <laughs> now I know <laughs> this initial right here, we talked about Genesis 3, 9 through 12, where God had said, well, where are you, Adam? Oh, I was afraid. I was afraid I was going to prison. Where are you, Sheriff? <laughs> Where are you? Now, should I play God today? Because I can. <laughs> You'd be surprised, huh? That anointing that I have that puts judges in prison, that puts those elected to office in prison. See, <laughs> that's worn oath of office. Yes. <laughs> it seems to be real, and it's something that is a part of the process. Yes. <laughs> Now, human judges must do the same. <laughs> then he formulated an expression of a defendant's right to a trial and to due process. <laughs> now, I've had this problem, yeah, <laughs> of those in the judiciary that said, well, we don't have to give him notice of court hearings, and if he disagrees, he can motion the court. <laughs> well, that's not the procedure for, <laughs> for issuing a protection order. <laughs> you actually do have to give notice and the opportunity to be heard. <laughs> you can't use some woman saying that the guy is crazy. <laughs> now, uh, poo, poo, poo. <laughs> God could not condemn Adam with a child because even God must presume that Adam was innocent until proven guilty. <laughs> it seems that the court has forgotten about this concept of innocence. <laughs> you said I was crazy, right, mentally ill. <laughs> and I said, no, I'm not. <laughs> I told you that it was against the law to issue protection orders where there's forgeries, <clears throat> fraud, <laughs> kidnapping, hope. Now, what are you going to do to make the problem worse today? Ooh, now, a uh, glance. Oh, look at all of this. The big yellow there. The inquisitorial courts uh, searching out heresy seems the antithesis of due process and contrary to any conception of a defendant's rights. Now, this thought of personal service of the summons? Yes. The idea of getting the criminal complaints before having court hearings, right? <laughs> this concept of a magistrate not being the judge of the hearing right now. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, I'm the heretic. Yes. <laughs> I'm the individual, right, that was not going to do what the family said. <laughs> I'm not going to come around. 
I'm not going to come to find out. <laughs> I'm not going to eat the tree of good and evil. Po, 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 po. <laughs> now, uh, there was something about a man should not be alone. And <laughs> something that God said or Adam said to God. <laughs> Now, I told you that I wanted to speak to a certain somebody whose husband had committed the fraud. And you're in picture. Not good for me to be alone. <laughs> it would be better if you gave me my son so that they could reside with me. <laughs> be better if I spoke to Marilyn today because there was a reason that God made Eve <laughs> so that Adam wouldn't be alone. And... <laughs> This whole thought of me sleeping on an emergency bed while you decide to violate the laws of the United States. <laughs>